<laughs> Even the spirits don't want to be around you. Pump, <laughs> pump, beating them up. Picking on the spirits. Show them who's boss. <laughs> We're like halfway through now. Sleepy Amelia. It's a little sleepy. She's sleepy. <laughs> she a little sleepy. It always starts at the same point. And ends at the same point. Oh, she can't remember anything. I don't even think she knows who, what she is. Or who she is. No one knows. Except Puck maybe. I don't know. She doesn't even know who she is. No one knows who Amelia is. I'm still confused about Amelia. The Thorny Thicket. What, what are you naming? Fortnite locations? Like... <laughs> <laughs> The thorny thicket. Yo, let's drop thorny thicket. <laughs> Guys, mark it on your map. <laughs> thorny thicket. <laughs> that sounds like a Fortnite location. Yo, let's go to Greasy Grove. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Excuse me? I'm so confused. What are, the, what are these two beings? What are these two beings? What do they have to do with anything? Okay, he, he's the stronger one. Survival of the fittest goes to Gray Blob. What is that? It's all this random shit that keeps popping up. Like a fire horse, whatever that thing was that just got eaten. Uh, the Gray Blob, like, I have no clue. I guess we'll never know what it was. It was just some r random thing. That was water? Black water. Venom of a black serpent. There's some crazy ass creatures out here. We've barely scratched the surface of the ReZero world. All this crazy stuff still in here. Damn, you just crushed it up like some ice. Uh oh. You won't get there in time. Is he gonna go to the village? Are there people and animals in the forest? And you and that village cut ties with each other? Listen, Amelia. You stay in your treehouse or you're grounded. <laughs> Puck is loyal to the end. Oh, fire horse. Fire horse. Fire horse. Is that your boss, Puck? <laughs> Bro, this whole, this whole special is weird. I don't even know what's happening. Someone in this forest but me. You lie much. Yeah, we know. We know. Yes, 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 we know. Horsey. <laughs> Horsey. Insult. Mockery. Absolute denial. War declaration. Is that a snowboard, Amelia? Like an ice snowboard? Amelia, you should take up snowboarding. You know how sick that is? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, Puck is in the middle of a war, you know? Oh, it is a snowboard! <laughs> Let's go, Amelia! Snowboard! She's shredding! Skater Pro. Amelia's so cool. <laughs> She's so cool. Literally! <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Meanwhile, Puck's fighting the fire horse. Judge Evil, Judge Criminals. For mediation. What if they're looking for the witch? This, I guess this fire horse is looking for the witch. Conceal, half demon. Silver Witch. I already possess. He's bluffing. He was bluffing to get you to spill the beans, Puck. And then there's just this. The goop. Bro, they all hate you, but she's still gonna... How do we... How do you stop that? Like... You gonna build a dam? <laughs> Amelia and her spirits. She gonna call them all. Yeah, go Amelia, start shredding. <laughs> So she's gonna draw it all to her. That red spirit, I feel like that red spirit is something important. <laughs> Wasn't there a red spirit in season one? That was uh, Julius's thing, right? Juculius's. <laughs> she's shredding. Can I? Did it end like this? I haven't done anything or apologized to anyone yet. Let's go, Amelia! Goodbye. Farewell. She went Super Saiyan? What, what's happening? Dude, Amelia is a little badass. <laughs> she's a little... I, I don't mean like she's a little badass. I mean she's a little 
badass. She's a little, but she's a badass. Our little badass. Free! Freeze! <laughs> okay. Amelia, you got this. Bro, imagine she freezes the village. <laughs> what, they're even- they're bailing? They're bailing? Like, listen, this is too much for me, man. I, I thought we were just gonna, like, I don't know, hunt for some rocks. Like, <laughs> I didn't expect this. I mean, you did it, but you made more of these rocks. She's becoming strong and independent. And now you're dependent on these spirits. Oh my god. It just doesn't end. She almost got obliterated. Oh, goodbye. You did- you did- you did good work, boys. Is it Fire Horse? Yup, it's Fire Horse. That look on your face is exactly what I wanted to see. Oh, he was the spirit thing. Spirits that disappeared in your place can't rest in peace if you're like that. Oh! I am the man you and your spirit put through hell. As you can see, I've acquired the power to get revenge. Okay. I lent him my body in return for revenge. And thanks to that, I'm feeling fantastic. Yeah, you didn't do anything wrong. Simple and clear. Because... It gave me a chance to see you cry. Bro, you just doubled down. Yes, Puck. Puck, where are you? Bro, you're about to see the full wrath of Amelia in a second. She is no criminal, she's just pretending to be a criminal. She's role-playing a criminal. <laughs> Damn, that's a little bit of Megumin in your voice. Laughter unavoidable. I'll burn up your friends too. My goal, your annihilation. Destroy the half-demon. Racist? And she's like, well, shit. <laughs> well, shit, I mean... Huh? Wait, you didn't know? Look at your ears! You didn't know?! <laughs> She didn't know? Look at your- Well, you know what, when I think about it, she hasn't looked in a mirror. <laughs> what? If you came here to kill me, you must know, right? What did I do? Why is the entire f f forest frozen? What did I do to all of them? Yeah, that's, that's what we're all, we're all wondering. Why does everyone hate me? She's just asking questions. Dude, she, she, didn't, she never knew. And he's gonna be like, FUCK YOU! <laughs> FUCK YOU! I... know nothing. I don't know anything about the crimes you've committed. Then why are you after me? Good point! She's making some good points! Why do people always hate me for reasons I can't do anything about? Mmm... Mmm, Amelia's relatable! I'm indifferent to your personal affairs. You are a half-demon. You are a witch. Simply being alive is your sin. Wow! Poor girl. You deserve life, Amelia. She was literally just born. That's the answer. I'm Amelia. I'm just Amelia. I don't know anything about half demons or witches. Look at me. Tell me about me. He's like, oh shit, I don't... I mean, I didn't, I didn't, <laughs> I, I just came here to kill you, like, I didn't come here to, like, I don't know, get me therapy, like, shit. <laughs> judge, mediator. Then judge her! Don't judge the witch! Judge her! Judge her! Puck. Call out, call out Puck's name and... Baboom. Baboom. Babushk. Babushk! <laughs> Babushk! <laughs> I'm gonna call my name right at the start. Good job, Amelia. The world, the world. I'm sick of hearing that. <laughs> Just so you know. No one cares about the world as much as you do. I mean, technically he's the good guy, but at the same time, Amelia deserves to live. She didn't do anything wrong. I wish you wouldn't underestimate me, Amelia. Sure, based on appearances, he definitely looks a little stronger. But Puck, Puck is built different! 
Clutch Puck! Clutch Puck coming in! Oh, you say, if that's what you think. You turn into shaved ice right now. Bro, who are you? <laughs> Goodbye. Don't underestimate Puck. I know, I'm a cat, but still. What you call burning flesh is to crush the yard. And with that, you're gone. Phew! Millie, you had like an emotional breakdown there. She needs a hug. Puck, hug her. She needs a hug. Puck, did you know? How did you not know? You didn't like look in the water for a second? <laughs> like, like you couldn't see your own reflection for a second? Melia, there are no half demons. You can't call yourself that. I mean, there are demons. <laughs> Technically, there are demons in this world. It's true, you're different from the elves in this forest. You're a half elf. Wait, they're full. Wait, so maybe they're full elves. Then what's the other half? <laughs> well, like human, bro? Like, <laughs> if I known I had blood, that blood in me, I wouldn't. Wait, is a half elf different from a regular elf? I don't know. I don't know, bro. I don't know, but. Elf bad. <laughs> Elf equal bad. And Amelia. Oh my god, it doesn't end! Who shot Puck? The fuck? Still here, aren't you? Just one final, one final little, little fucking send off, like. Companion, folly. Result, obvious. Mediation, unhindered. I am mediated. Yeah, yeah, we know! <laughs> We know! Jesus, man. If you hate me, that's fine. You've hurt my lesser spirits and Puck, too. Denial. My actions remove obstacle. Companion. Sacrifice. You are sin. Her being alive just hurts everyone. Why was I the only one to awaken from within the ice? Was I born to bring misfortune to others? Affirmation, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you involve others, you acquaintance disaster, you threat destruction, world balance, your existence, grave sin, whole world crave your death. Yikes. Now we now I know why Amelia was so why why Amelia was so Amelia in season one. To hell with that. Even in death, Puck is gonna speak up for his, for his girl. She was. Amelia was born because she was wanted. She was celebrated. She's going to find happiness. Puck! Even in death, Puck. Puck speaking the words of the truth. Puck speaks the truth. Nothing but the truth. How is this girl a threat to the world? She's nothing but a crying child. For the one who created a dangerous situation with the black serpent's venom. And framed her for it and forced her into fighting. Details argument meaningless. You and I would have done the same thing if we were put in danger. You're saying she's not allowed to do what anyone else would do. Yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> this is that is fate. Fate. Should you interfere too deeply in her life? Everything that makes you what you are. Your memories, feelings, and goals. They will all be lost. You unfroze her. Did you? I won't lose to some cheap concept like fate. Neither will she. Bring it on, fate. As Natsuki Subaru would say. <laughs> Amelia, let's... In other words, you will cease to be you. What does that mean, though? What does that mean? Let's form a contract. Ha <laughs> ha! Be quiet, Malakora. It's the sacred dialogue between a spirit and his contractor. You're always on about rules, so you don't know which one you can interfere. Puck broke the rules! Sorry, this isn't the most romantic setting. <laughs> Puck! <laughs> I'll make it clear right now. You're precious to me. I want to protect you forever. You were born to be happy. I want to help you achieve that. Oh my gosh. Amelia. Puck. 
Puck. <laughs> the way I said it, I'm just like, Puck. I don't think you'll find many people who will love you forever the way I will. Is that why Puck is always jealous of Subaru? <laughs> because he does? <laughs> Bro, Puck and Subaru are more alike than I thought. <laughs> but boom. Love. Companionship. Because you summon me. For you, I can become anything. And is this what Amelia decided on? A big furry? A Garfield? Four great contaminants. The Beast of End! Puck was the Beast of End. I'm not too fond of that old moldy old nickname though. Hindrance, disgust, fear. Why you protect? He's someone who can work hard to find happiness. No matter what state the world is in. She won't become a witch. You are half demon. You are witch encumbrance. World balance destroy. Better. <laughs> Can you deny suspicion? Better. Seems I am a half elf. Bro, how did you not know though? You couldn't like look in a mirror? My silver hair and eye color represents the rich. Really immense power that sleeps within me. I don't understand why you say that's dangerous. I'm weak and dependent on others. So if I'm alone, what happened today will, will probably happen again. It scares me a lot. But Puck's gonna stay with me. So I won't become a witch. I am Amelia. Half who was born and lives in the forest. Let's go! She's Amelia and Amelia only! Get that witch bullshit out of your mind. Yes, we know! Fuck! God, we know! Imagine just like going on a hike and you see this. And this battle's over. Could I call you Leah? Puck never left. Yes, we- You just said it. <laughs> my name is Puck. At least remember my name before you die. I am Amelia. Just Amelia. I was born with that name. And I'll live with it until I die. I won't ever. Forget you. Self-acceptance. <laughs> Bro, whose grave is that, huh? <laughs> If you had died, you wouldn't be seeing the sunset. There's still so many pleasures in this world. Precious as jewels, waiting to bring you joy. Because he was scared. The reason I never mentioned forming a contract to you was because I took an oath. Yeah, the oath. Can't say with whom, though. An oath. To stop you from forming a contract with me. So it wasn't with Malaquera or whatever? Who was it with? If it wasn't Malaquera or whatever. Quirky key. <laughs> Quirky. <laughs> Actually, I'm not sure what's going to happen. But it'll be fine. I don't need to worry, Amelia. For me, just being able to stay with you is enough. What it was Puck? Maybe. I haven't taken this form in a while, so I got careless. Puck, did you apologize to me back then too? So it was Puck. It was Puck that let her go. You had only just awakened, so you were confused. But I was happy. You needed me. In truth, I was going through a rough time back then too. It had been centuries since I had been born. I never experienced that before. Never experienced what before? Feeling glad to be alive. The first time I'd ever felt happy. Bro, the fa father, daughter. <laughs> Just a proud parent. <laughs> For all the time I'd spent with you in this forest since you woke up. You've given me happiness. Puck, there's something I was never able to tell you too. No secrets, no secrets. <laughs> I love you, Puck. Ah, best father. <laughs> but that was the first thing you said to me. Wait, Puck. 
You making you're just making up things that I don't remember? It's quite a thing to say, my daughter. <laughs> Are you calling me your daughter? I know it's not as if you remember it now. That seems like you felt the same way. So I'm done keeping all my affection locked up too. Oh man, the full story. The full story. The full story, shit. Guess I left you alone. You left me alone? Guess I couldn't find you after all this time. Have we ever seen Puck cry? I'm right here. What's your name? My name is... You made up a new name. Not the Beast of N, but... Puck. My name is Puck. All this time, from now on too, my spirit meant just for you. When you're scared, when you're sad, I'll protect you. When you're having fun, when you're happy, I'll share your joy, if you'll allow it. Father? <laughs> father? Does that mean you're my father? <laughs> Dumbass Amelia. <laughs> I'll stay by your side and protect you. Best father. Father of the year. Right here. In that case, from now on, I'm your father. You can depend all you want on me, Amelia. It's not Amelia, remember? Puck, you said you weren't gonna call me Amelia. You said you'd call me something else. <laughs> Leah. You're right, can't I? These two are just so awesome. <laughs> she's so cute when she's stuttering. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> There's no need for you to rush. Leah. Bro, they're both moving on from their past, bro. My water bottle just fell. <laughs> I'm not gonna pick it up. <laughs> I'm too invested. <laughs> Shut up. Is it leaking? Okay, no, it isn't. <laughs> it's just like there's a huge puddle on the ground. <laughs> bro, they're both moving on. They were both able to find happiness. And that's just how it ends? <sighs> The show is just ho so hopeful, you know? Even without the context of like magic and uh, half elf, demon, fire horses, green, I mean green, black goop everywhere. Like if you take away all of that, it's still, it's still like a relatable and sad story about a girl who thinks she was just born for nothing. That she was born to make the world a shitty place. That she shouldn't be alive. And then we got Puck. Spirit that was born to be a monster. A beast of end. But now it's just Puck. It's just Puck and it's just Amelia. Fuck Satella and fuck the, the beast of end. They're not them. There's Puck and Amelia. What a great segue back into the show. Okay, what is this ha- I'm glad I watched this now because this shit had nothing to do with season 2. Unless Fire, Ho Fire Horse comes back. Fire Horse. <laughs> Best character. <laughs> Best character. Fire Horse. <laughs> Father of the Year award. <laughs> Goes to Puck. Great writing. Great writing. Great story. The dialogue was great. Just more of ReZero, you know? Oh, it's great to be back. <sighs> White Fox. Bro, why does your it, it says white fox? That looks like a mouse, dude. <laughs> it's a fucking mouse, dude. You can't tell me that isn't a mouse. White mouse. Beaten. Beaten. What if it was like an after credit scene? That'd be hilarious. Oh yeah, there is. Shit. <laughs> oh. Is this present day? You were a huge help. Thanks both of you. <laughs> <laughs> my boy! My boy! I'm beaten! <laughs> my boy! Glad we're here. You just finished the repairs. I mean, when we got back from our <laughs> date yesterday. You look sad when, when you started to see this family sculpture start to melt. Ah, uh, Subaru, you don't even know. You wouldn't tell me why. 
what brings you all out here so early in the morning? <laughs> ram, ram. <laughs> it's only been three months and I've missed these guys. I don't. I didn't realize how much I miss these guys. <sighs> you don't even know what you did, Subaru. Don't mention it. If it made you happy, that's enough for me, Amelia Tan. Ah, I guess it was no use after all. Yo, what did you think, Subaru? It's a it's snow! <laughs> there's no such thing as snow that doesn't melt. And there's no such thing as ice that doesn't melt either. Smooth pickup line. That's a smooth line. You think one day they'll melt? Maybe one day. I mean, if the temperature is consistent enough, maybe they'll just stay frozen forever. <laughs> I guess even Subaru says the right things sometimes. That's right. There's no such thing as ice that doesn't melt. I believe that too. One day, I'm sure, all those elves will be free one day. Ah, oh God, who knows when? <laughs> right? <laughs> the frozen bond. Bro, if their bond is frozen, then it's gonna melt. <laughs> no! <laughs> that was re zero. The frozen bond. Excellent story. Excellent. Excellent story. I almost missed that end credit scene, dude. <laughs> Subaru. And we're also all. Ram. Rem. Amelia. Puck. All coming back. Season 2. And I think. If you guys are seeing this. Then I can. I can say. That. Season 2 starts. Next week. Or, or the week after that. I don't know. In April. And we're gonna get, get back into it. Part 1. I have intention of doing in this first half of the year. Part 2. It's kind of unknown. If I'll ever get to it. It might be really. It'll be a while before I get to it. But yeah, that was ReZero, The Frozen Bond. Like I said, great story. Uh, wholesome story. Wholesome. It was, it was, it was really self-contained. I don't know why people said watch it halfway through season two. Like, I guess the whole elves, I guess those elves are going to be unfrozen at some point. And they're going to, they, they remember what happened i don't <laughs> yeah and then and then they're gonna cause problems for amelia but i'm guessing this first half of the show okay so we kind of have we kind of know what's gonna happen now so i'm guessing this first half of the show is gonna be royal selection stuff uh all that jazz we're gonna get that plot line wrapped up in those 12 episodes then the second half is gonna be the witch stuff it's gonna deal with these frozen elves or whatever and then we're gonna finally get some resolution on the story dude when did part two come out i feel like it's a bad idea to look at it but when did part two come out i need to know because uh 2021 what the hell wow wow i didn't expect 2021 huh so I'm not that late to the party, you know? I started it in 2021. The show was over <laughs> by then, but... Season 2, Part 2. And Season 1... Season 2, Part 1, and Season 2, Part 2. I'm looking forward to it. But yeah. If, if I do have it, why don't we get a sneak peek at my Episode 1 reaction, you know? For those who watch this. <laughs> Play it. If, if I have it, you know. Otto, why is Otto the first man we have to see on the screen? Like, get out of here. <laughs> get out of here. They are so cute. <laughs> Petra, quit being a cock block. You just have to smile and laugh off the things kids say. Absolutely not. <laughs> it's actually about rare. Oh, uh oh. <laughs> no, not again. Not again. Oh. Shut up, Yuki. <laughs> Shut up, Yuki. No, please, no. Please, no. No, I am so done with this. Oh, no. The fuck is that? Dude, he didn't even get a five-minute break, and now we're back. 
Oh, man, give this guy a break. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> she just doesn't have the insurance. <laughs> Shut up, Felix! <laughs> but yeah, that was ReZero, the Frozen Bond. All right. See you guys. For season two. About time. All right, see you guys.